How's it going guys, Yugi by TCG here. It is day 11 of Yugi Miss. We have one day left. Today we're gonna to be opening up this Magician's Force Korean box. Tomorrow we're gonna to be opening up the Ruxin and Ruxin 34 and Sassy Auto um, mystery boxes. Those are gonna be a ton of fun to open. Um, from what I've seen, they're pretty, pretty good mystery boxes. So hopefully they do it again in the future. Um, we got three of them, so it should be a pretty fun. I tried to order more, they already sold out, so that's good though. I hope a lot of people got a chance to get them. Oh, this box is all taped up. Well, at least we know we're not going to probably get scammed because I have had Korean box, only one, where they pulled all the good cards out already. So I don't think that'll be today, but hopefully we can pull something good out of Magician's Force. The last time we opened it was so long ago now, but we did actually pull the Dark Magician Girl. So if we can pull another Dark Magician Girl, that'd be absolutely crazy. Um, we also pulled Dark Paladin, so we've literally pulled all the heaters. So I'm just hoping we can have a pretty good opening today. Um, if you haven't seen that video, I'm going to try and link it because that was a pretty insane opening. But maybe we'll pull another Dark Magician Girl of the day. That would be absolutely crazy if we pull another one. I mean, if we pull another Dark Magician Girl, I'm going to go nuts. That would be absolutely crazy. So nothing. Oh. God, can you imagine we would have went to a Dark Magician Girl right there? That would have been crazy. Alright. But there are some other good hits. We haven't gotten Breaker the Magical Warrior. Still need that one. I mean, technically we need Diffusion Wave Motion. I'd way rather have Dark Magician Girl, obviously. But, obviously I'll take a secret. Error. So we start with, oh my god, what is the name of this card? It's like Magician of White or something. That's our first super. So, starting off pretty good so far. Amazon's Blowpiper. <laughs> XYZ Dragon Tank or XYZ Tank Cannon, something like that. God, how why can I not remember the name of this? I actually have a first edition of this card. Very beat up. This is from my childhood, but very, very cool. Okay, I might need to mix these up a bit more. We just shuffled them though. That's gotta be just a coincidence that we pulled the supers like that. Okay, that's good. Alright, I don't want to pull them all at once and then have nothing to look forward to later in the opening. Now, unless we pull Dark Magician Girl, we can pull that one ever. That one I'll take whenever it wants to appear. Because so obviously Dark Magician Girl is very hard to pull. So basically, Secret Rares, I think, for this set, were like for like the Korean ones, are one in three booster boxes. So think about it as one in six will be a Dark Magician Girl. Because there's two secrets. So it is pretty unlikely. But not impossible. I mean, Trihorn I pull all the time. Maybe it's one in two boxes. Now I can't remember. Then it would be one in four. That would be a much better chance. I'm trying to remember now. Is it one in three or one in two? For Korean. Obviously, I think English I think is one in three. But no one's busting out Magician Force boxes these days. Pretty expensive. They are coming down though, so God, I hope one day they can come down enough to where the hobby will go back to normal. And I can finally open some really old school sets. Apprentice Magician, I believe is the name of that card. Because there's Apprentice Illusion Magician, I believe, is the the like not like the retrain, but like the way better card. It's a, lot, it's a lot newer card as well. But I think that's just Apprentice Magician. But it's not part of the Dark Magician archetype. I think this is Amazonist Paladin. Something like that. Amazonist Tiger. A lot of Amazonist cards. A lot of the... All the pieces to make like... Kaiba's... Um, XYZ cards are in here. Um, I see a bunch of Dark Magician cards, Dark Paladins in here, Dark Magician Girl. 
Uh, Breaker the Magical Warrior. I think Chaos Command's also in here. Which we don't have, I believe. A Korean version of it. <laughs> XZ. Oh my god. How do I not remember the names of these? Well, we'll put it in. The, obviously, it'll be in the video, the name. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of those cards. Like, I think they're cool and they're nostalgic and everything, but I like the Magician cards. That's why we're opening this for sure. So, we've already hit three Super Rare, so we really only should have one more. It'd be cool if we got the other Fusion, but that actually might be an Ultra Rare. Then I don't want it. I'd rather have other Ultra Rares from this set. But it was cool when Kaiba used those. I think, who else used those cards? Wasn't it, um... Didn't Chaz use them at some point in GX? Am I, am I not thinking right? Let's see what else we can get. Like the Skull Servant is in that artwork very cool i do wish you could pull i wish they would have done this for the korean one just because i think they printed these like very recently like i should say like not super long ago they should have put both dark paladin artworks in here that would have been actually really cool but they basically just took the sets and reprinted them it wasn't really like any thought put into it but that would have actually been really cool just because Dark Paladin had two artworks in this set. One was first edition and one was an unlimited. Oh, so that's not great. I would have taken a lot of other supers. Forget the exact name of this one. It's probably one of the weaker ones. I think we've pulled it before. I think we've opened up two boxes previously to this one. I actually got a bunch of hits in the one. But we still haven't hit our ultras, so we still have a lot of... Uh, we still have two chances at a really good card. And then, obviously, it's randomly inserted if there's going to be a secret. Why is there a Buster Blader card in here? Oh, Dark Paladin. That kind of makes sense. That actually does make sense. Yo, Dark Paladin is Buster Blader and Dark Magician. So that actually does make a little bit of sense. Why wow, there would be some Buster Plater support in here. Okay, now it's an effect monster in the back. I mean, there probably has got to be a couple effect rares, but I mean. Oh, it's Breaker! There we go. That's a good ultra rare hit. Nice. Very nice ultra rare hit. I will take a breaker all day. It's one of the ones I was looking for. If we can pull breaker and chaos command and then still pull dark condition girl, the secret rare. God, that'd be crazy. It wouldn't be better than the last one we did because we did pull dark paladin. But if we pulled dark paladin and dark condition girl after these ones, that would be pretty crazy. I would take a dark paladin as well. Obviously, dark paladin's awesome. It's one of my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh cards of all time. If we could get one of them graded, which would be fun. Because I do have like a Dark Magician binder. So I like to only get my re or like my co my copies or like cards I have two of um, graded because I like to keep my binder looking the way it is. My binder does look very amazing. At least to me, like I've, it's built perfectly for what I want. I've actually have changed it recently. Um, originally, I had a bunch of binders. And now I've kind of gone down to one big binder. So I do like that a little better because it has a bunch of different. Uh, has like I have like one with all my OG like archetype cards, not really like OG cards. Like some of them have obviously been printed more recently, but. Has like the Dark Magician, Dark Magician Girl, Red Eyes, Blue Eyes. I think that has Jinzos in it. Oh my god, I forgot about this monster. I don't remember the name of it. 
Um, stuff like that's in there. But, come on. If we can pull a Dark Magician Girl today, that'd be nuts to pull another one. The Eugimus has been pretty solid. We've had some pretty good luck, so maybe we can continue that luck into today. All right. So we either have one card left or two. If we have a Seeker Rare, there's two left. If we have an Ultra Rare, then there's just or one Ultra. Then we'll have only one card left if there's no Secret. Man, it's really going to turn down to the wire. And we still have quite a few packs. These packs are so skinny compared to the packs we get in English. So it looks like we have a, like only a few left, but there's still probably like five or maybe a little more than that. Oh, so we got XY. Um, so this isn't a... I thought this was a super. It's an ultra. Okay. So this was the one I was talking about. So we did pull all the fusions except for like the one where they're all combined. That's pretty cool. I will take that. It's pretty awesome. Now we just need Dark Magician Girl. For some reason, I feel like we were going to pull it. I don't know why I feel that way. But I feel like it's going to happen. All right. Uh, Five packs left, I believe, including this one. I just feel like Dark Magician Girl's in here. I don't know why I feel like that. I just I have a gut feeling that we're going to pull it. Just feel like there's, we're going to pull one more hollow. Could be Diffusion Wave Motion, but I feel like it's going to be Dark Magician Girl. I have seen three Ultra boxes before, too, so that would be kind of cool. Just because I've never done that before in Korean. It's got three packs left. I don't know why I have so much optimism right now, but I feel like there's just one more in here. Obviously, at this point, I'll take a Diffusion Wave Motion just to get the seventh hollow. All right. I'm calling this is the one with Dark Magician Girl. I, for a second, I really thought, I'm like, no, Dark Condition Girl is in effect, not a normal. All right. Last chance. I don't, now I don't feel so confident, but let's see. So nothing. All right. I guess I just, uh, I, I really did think we were going to pull one today. I don't know why. I just had very high hopes. So we got the XY Fusion. We got, I forget the name of this one. I forget the name of most of these, to be honest. We got the XZ, and then we have the YZ. And then we have the, I can't remember the name. It's White Magician, I believe. I, I'm very bad with the names when they're in Korean. I'm sorry. I don't know why. Um, but the big hit was Breaker the Magical Warrior. That was probably the best card we hit. Didn't have this one yet, so that's definitely good. It's definitely off-centered, so it wouldn't be a gradable one, unfortunately. But very, very cool, so... Um, tomorrow will be the last day. Definitely check it out. We're going to be opening up Ruxin 34 and Sauce TCG. Not Sauce. Sassy Auto in Ruxin 34. Like these mystery packs they did, they are pretty sweet. So we'll definitely see what we can pull tomorrow. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy the last day of Yugi Miss uh, tomorrow.